Helen McNallan from Worksop has been battling depression for over 10 years. I was working in the city as a trader, enjoying my job, um, playing hard, working hard. Changed companies, I was expected to do um, everything because they thought I was superwoman coming from my last company and I had a breakdown after a year. So that led me to being in the hospital for three months in the Priory in London and courses of antidepressants, tried to kill myself and ended up being unconscious for a couple of days and woke up in and sectioned actually in a mental hospital. And the festive period was sometimes particularly difficult. Remember New Year's Eve counting down and everybody standing in a circle, all having a fantastic time, looking forward to the new year. And I was just thinking, I don't want to be here, I want to be in my bed, I want to die, I don't want next year to come. And concerns like this are all too familiar at the Samaritans here in Bradford. It could be a difficult time because you've got your friends and your family around you and, and you still inside to feel so miserable and so depressed, but you go through everything, you put on a brave face... I think there's pressure on people to perform and not acknowledge their real feelings. Um, but, you know, we're here. And Helen's proof you really can beat depression. She's battled through and has now set up a website helping others. I, mean, I can't stop the world going through what I went through, not naive enough to think that, but I hopefully can make a small difference with psychiatrists and psychologists on there to help support uh, people. And if anyone knows how important that support can be... It's Helen. Oh, fine. Yeah. Neil Smallburn, BBC Look North, Worksop. Do you know Marissa Pierre? Uh,